The Governing Council decided today to keep the three key ECB interest rates unchanged. The incoming information has broadly confirmed our previous assessment of the medium-term inflation outlook. Inflation has continued to fall, led by lower food and goods price inflation. If our updated assessment of the inflation outlook the dynamics of underlying inflation and the strength of monetary policy transmission were to further increase our confidence that inflation is converging to our target in a sustained manner, it would be appropriate to reduce the current level of monetary policy restriction. In any event, we will continue to follow a data-dependent and meeting-by-meeting -meeting approach to determining the appropriate level and duration of restriction. And we are not pre-committing to a particular rate path. I have said in the past that we are data dependent. We are not Fed dependent. That was not the Fed, that was CPI numbers. And obviously, anything that happens matters to us and will in due course be embedded in the projection that will be prepared and released in June. The economy remained weak in the first quarter. While spending on services is resilient, manufacturing firms are facing weak demand and production is still subdued, especially in energy-intensive sectors. Surveys point to a gradual recovery over the course of this year, led by services.